Good evening, everyone. Joe for Jaspi's CaseBreaks.com coming at you with 2019 Gold Rush Autograph Football Jerseys. Uh, all six boxes, full case break, random player break number one from Jaspi's CaseBreaks.com. We sold 30 spots, and one spot will get you five players. So let's multiply this list by five. So there's one already, two, three, four, and five. And then you saw in the item description the whole player list right there. There's 150 players on this list. A couple combos. I copy that list of players already right here. All right, let's roll the dice. Let's randomize each list seven times. Let's see who you end up with. Your names first. Two and a five. Seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seventh and final time. After seven times, we've got Mike Bobby all the way down to John Hyanga. And I'll first, I'll show you the, when I randomize the players and copy and paste in here, I'll show you the list just as is, and then I'll um, or sort them by your first name so you'll be able to see everything. All right, once again, seven times for the players. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seventh and final time. Good luck. After seven times, we've got Bradley Chubb all the way down to Terrell Pryor. All right, so... There's the list as is. And once again, I'll, I'll alphabetize by your first names in just a second. Almost at the end of the list. All right, now let's sort your sort this list by your first names. So Brian Bledsoe, there are your players right there. Colton. You got the Watt brothers comboed up. John. Joe. Other Joe. J Mac. Kyle Hoover. Logan. Mark, other Mark, Michael Calder, other Michael, Seal Curtain, Mike Bobby, Nick L, Patrick K, more Patrick K, last by Mojo Patrick K, Rick K, Rolando Lewis, Stephen K, Steve Locke, Tim Martin, and TJ Poyer. Now, trades are allowed if you want. Joe Matthews says, anyone want Antonio Brown? If you missed your name on here, let me know, and I can scroll back down to it again. I'll give everyone a few moments. Stephen Wilkinson, wait. What are we dusting off Eloy Jimenez autos for? You just pulled a out of 100 out of prison retail today. He hit two three-run homers against the Yankees today. He's heating up. All right. <clears throat> Carmonas would take 
Antonio Brown. If any of these guys interest you. Joe Matthews. Geis owner is Patrick K, who is a Redskins fan, TJ Porter. So yeah, I don't think he's gonna be he's gonna be moving that that player. Six autographed jerseys. I think Carmonis is asking for is suggesting Troy for Antonio Brown, Joe Matthews countering Diggs for Brown. I'm assuming Antonio Brown would be in his in a Steelers jersey. I'm not sure. I guess we'll find out. Pull him. I'm gonna open up that case right there while you guys are thinking. There it is. I'm sure they have those names on there. <clears throat> um, Sterling Shepard for Diggs, maybe, if that does anything for you. Otherwise, we'll go, otherwise we'll rock and roll. All right, looks like no deals. Some trade offers out there, but it's like that's that. TWC trade window closed. All right. Good luck, everybody. Six autographed football jerseys coming your way. Maybe we can. Wonder if they're they have those name if they have the name stickered on here. I'm sure they do. My knife over there. All right, a little, we'll do a quick round of who am I. Got six of these, it won't take too long. All right, <clears throat> excuse me, who am I? I am an active American football defensive end in the National Football League. 6'5", 295, from Pewaukee, Wisconsin. I guess I was born in Wakasha, Wisconsin. But I went to high school in Pewaukee, Wisconsin. Went to college in Wisconsin. Played for one team my entire career. Still active. Five-time Pro Bowler. Five-time first-team All-Pro. He's pretty good. Pro Bowl defensive MVP. Burt Bell Award. Two-time NFL sacks leader. I have a total of 455 total tackles in my, what, eight, nine-year career. 51 pass deflections, 92 sacks, 22 forced fumbles, 12 fumble recoveries, one interception, two defensive touchdowns. This guy's pretty incredible. Nick Stanley's got it. Yep. It's J.J. Watt. Turn down for Watt. There's your JSA stuff here. The card, the sticker right here on the inside. I'm going to try to keep it nicely folded in there. And there's his autograph. Looks like looks like a custom jersey. No tags or anything like that there, but you will have his last name on the other side right here. Very cool. Who's got J.J. Watt? Let me alphabetize this by player now. 
That's the J.J. Watt, T.J. Watt combo spot. Going to Colton Carver. Nice. Thanks for the update, Johnny. I saw the Padres creeping back a little bit, but it looks like the Rockies pulled ahead again. All right, there you go, Colton. Very nice. I thought that other one was going to fall out of there. Next one, who do we have here? Huh? JSA, all right. Who am I? I'm an active running back in the NFL. I was born in uh, San Francisco, California. 22 years old, 6'1", 237 running back. My career stats, I have 1,794 rushing yards, 12 rushing touchdowns, 73 recep receptions for 583 receiving yards, one receiving touchdown. Six one two thirty seven. born in San Francisco, went to college in Oklahoma. I was the AFC rushing yards leader. AFC. Went to high school in Northern California. Went to college at Oklahoma. Drafted in 2017 in the second round. Pick 48 overall. Um, there you go. Patrick Kay's got it. It is Joe Mixon. There's the JSA sticker down here. It's Joe Mixon's autograph right on his old number 28. You can see Mixon on the back as well. I'm going to keep it nicely folded in here. I wonder if this is... No, this is a... Let's tell by the tag that just... A replica, but that's okay. His autograph is real. And let's see who has Joe Mixon. That's Patrick Kay with Joe Mixon. There you go, Patrick. You guessed your hit. Carmo says you, you need to make it uh, you need to make it where the who am I winner gets some type of reward. They get bragging rights. No better reward. No better reward than telling people that I was right and you were wrong. No, most of these are not going to be authentic jerseys. I mean, leave. Most products aren't authentic jerseys. It'd be way too expensive. Those game worns, or not game well, game worns would be really expensive. Authentic ones would be would also be expensive. Expensive, but I think sometimes they mix in. Yeah, Joe Matthews saying sometimes they'll mix in an authentic jersey, which will obviously increase its value even more. All right, next one. Who do we have here? We have. Huh. Okay. All right. 
I got it. Who am I? America's favorite game. Who am I? I'm a retired quarterback. I'm 49 years old. I played for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight different teams. I'm a four time Pro Bowler. Through 161 touchdowns to my 83 receptions, over 25,500 passing yards, an 87.5 passer rating. I also played in the CFL for the Calgary Stampeders before I went to went into the NFL. Played in the CFL for four years, throwing for over 16,000 yards, 111 touchdowns to 52 interceptions, 94.9 passer rating. Born in Gilroy, California, went to high school in Gilroy, California, went to college in San Jose State, went undrafted in 1994, went to the CFL for four years. Not Chris Chandler, not, not Montana, not Jimmy G, not Brunel, not Jake Delhomme, not Steve Young, not Flutie, not Kirk, not... Flutie, not Flutie, not Brunel, not Warner, not Charlie Whitehurst. Um, I'm trying to give some other clues. Okay, so the first team that I was on, I just have to give this clue now. First team that I was on after the CFL were the San Francisco 49ers from 1999 to 2003. This is kind of a blast from the past. So I was on the Niners from 1999 to 2003. Nice. Grant Watson got it. There you go, Grant. It's Jeff Garcia. I haven't thought about this guy in a minute or two. There's his JSA. The JSA sticker right there. There's his autograph. Nice, this is another replica jersey here, but nice Jeff Garcia going to Kyle Hoover. Break number one. Jeff Garcia also played for the Browns, Lions for a year, Eagles for a year, Tampa Bay Buccaneers for a couple years. It's like Raiders practice squad, Eagles again, Omaha Nighthawks. All right. Another round of America's Favorite Game. Who am I? I give you clues. You try to guess it for bragging rights. Who are you? Oh, is that, is it this guy? color of the uniform kind of threw me off. I don't, don't think of it that way. Um, okay, who am I? I'm an active running back in the NFL. I was born in Memphis, Tennessee, but went to high school in Iowa. I've been, I was drafted in 2015, was the only 
uh, but only on one team my entire career. Pro Bowl in 2016, I have career 2,783 rushing yards, 31 rushing touchdowns, 1,849 receiving yards, 11 receiving touchdowns, 598 return yards, and one return touchdown. Boom, there you go. Grant Watson again. David Johnson. What gave it away? I don't think I gave too many clues. Maybe Iowa, maybe? All right, so yeah, I just, I just didn't think of this... Uh, the black with the red numbers kind of threw me off. There's David Johnson's autograph right there. There's his JSA right over there. Johnson on the back. David Johnson, where are you going to go? You're going to go to JMAC. So there you go, Justin. All right, two more to go. What if it was, Steve Locke, what if it was a back-to-back -back Jeff Garcia? Like, you rarely see Jeff Garcia autographs in any product, and all of a sudden, two back-to-back. -back. All right, next person. Huh. Hmm. Really? Hmm. Okay. This guy's okay. This guy's all right. I am a retired running back in the NFL. Played for only two teams my entire career. I'm a decent player, five-time Pro Bowler, three-time first-team All-Pro, three-time second-team All-Pro, and NFL MVP, no big deal. NFL Offensive Player of the Year, no problem. Walter Payton, NFL Man of the Year, two-time NFL rushing yards leader, three-time NFL rushing touchdowns leader. He's okay. Part of the NFL's all-decade team. I was in college. I was a consensus All-American. My career stats rush for 13,000 yards, 13,684 yards, 4.3 yards of carry, 145 rushing touchdowns. 624 receptions, 4,772 receiving yards, 17 receiving touchdowns, a college football Hall of Famer, a pro football Hall of Famer. Wow. Um, was born in Rosebud, Texas. Danny's got it. Rosebud, Texas. Went to University High in Waco, Texas. Went to TCU. Drafted in 2001, round one, pick five by the Chargers in the classic powder blues right here. Hall of Fame inscription, LT Ladanian Tomlinson. There's the JSA right there. There's the autograph right here. Tomlinson on the back right here. Nice, LT. Who, who has LT? We got randomized Ladanian Thomas. So, wow. <laughs> That's another one for J Mac, Justin. With another one. Nice. And this is. It's like another custom jersey as well, but still very cool. They got, they got the Chargers powder blue just right.
All right, last one coming up. Dustin's on a heater today. You should see what he got in one of the earlier immaculate baseball breaks that we did. All right, the last one. This one's Beckett certified. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, I am a retired quarterback. Born in Manchester, Maryland. Played for the uh, the CFL and the NFL. And the CFL, I was a three-time Grey Cup champion and a three-time Grey Cup MVP, a six-time CFL Most Outstanding Player, a six-time CFL All-Star. I was a, a one-time Pro Bowler in the NFL, was an NFL Comeback Player of the Year, also, I'm a Heisman Trophy winner, Maxwell Award winner, Walter Camp Award winner. Everyone seems to like this guy, too. Yeah, Edward's got it. Edward, Rick, Stephen K. It's Doug Flutie. In the College Football Hall of Fame and in the Canadian Football Hall of Fame. Doug Flutie. There's his autograph in his uh, Boston College gear. Boston College BC colors. There's the Beckett stuff. There's Flutie on the back. Was he number 20? That doesn't feel like a quarterback number, right? 22. Drafted in 1985 as well. All right, let's see who got Doug Flutie. That goes to Kyle Hoover with Doug Flutie. So there you go, Kyle. And there you go, everyone. A nice uh, six autograph jersey break. Thanks for joining, everybody. We'll see you next time on jazbeescasebreaks.com. Bye-bye.